Hi everyone, it's Elaine. I just want to share with you this Valentine's project that I've been busy making lately. It's almost February and I have some Valentine's projects to share and the first one would be this uh, Valentine's treat boxes. Okay, let's start with this one. I have this one from my stash and I get I think I got this from Dollarama and I don't know how much it is because uh, I opened it already from last year and I'm not sure if you have five or six in this one but I altered two of them. So it looks like this when you open it and it's just easy to assemble. All you need to do is just do it like that and there you go. That's your box and it's supposed to look like this one so I altered them and decorated them to make it prettier the first one I did this one and for the trims that I use all of my projects I think I use this one this trim that I got from Walmart very pretty trim and it's so cheap look at that $2.98 and they're both pom-pom trim this one is a little bit bigger compared to the other one, but it's just like plain pom-pom. And the other one is smaller pom-poms, but it has a trim on the upper part, so I like this one. I, I, I think I use mostly this trim here. Okay, I'll show you the box that I altered. So I put the trim all over, that one, and the upper part, and the lower part I just put this uh, silver bling just like that and I put Michael's flower and I put this heart sticker and this be my valentine which is from a cut out from the paper of Martha Stewart paper so that's the first one that I altered so the picture says to do it like this one so that's what I did but you could also do it like this which is also cute I didn't push this all the way so there are two ways this one or like this and I like this one too so same thing I put the trim I put the bling in the lower part and just a cluster of flowers that I got from Dollar Tree and it's just very simple but it looks so pretty so when I was looking at this box it reminded me of one of the dies from my stash so I have this die that I got online this one I haven't tried using it. This is a small die and it just reminded me of the heart and it's square. So I decided to try using it. So this is the outcome of that one. It's quite small. It's two by two inches um, for the size. And very simple. I just use a pattern paper. But the thing is I had a hard time. Like if I want the, the upper part perfect square, this part here is crooked, but if I want this one square and the bottom part, this part here is crooked. So I decided it doesn't matter if the if the bottom part is crooked as long as this one is, it's perfect. So yes, I just put some bling all over in the top and bottom. And I just decorated with the shaker stickers that I got from Dollar Tree. So it looks like that. So you need to cut out two of this one here and I use two different papers so that's why this part here is different from this part here. So yeah, I had fun making this but uh, you cannot put much, maybe if you put just uh, M&Ms, so little or jelly beans, something like that, small, small stuff you can put inside. So that's the die that I use, this one here and another die that I use is a die that I got online. I'm pretty sure you're familiar with this one. This die here and I love this one. I really really do. Uh, it's the size is very uh, it's not very big and it's not very small so it's just perfect if you put some I tried putting some kisses in here and I think I could put almost 20 kisses. Anyway it's a good size. Um, it's three and three four the width is three and three fourth and the height from here to here it's almost four inches so it's a good size so for the papers that I use uh, I use this Martha Stewart paper that I got from Dollarama very nice paper and it's a very good deal I got this for four dollars so that's what I use for all my Valentine's projects for this year 
and what I did, so I just cut out the paper. You have to cut out two of this one, two of this one here, and yes, I just use Valentine stickers from my stash, mostly from Dollar Tree and Dollarama. I just put them together. This is a Hallmark sticker here. I use the same trim, and that's it. Very simple. That one, and here's another one. Same thing. I put trims on all of this uh, boxes here. So basically, I just did the same thing. Michael's flower and cluster of stickers there. And what I like with this paper, it's double-sided. So when you open it, so that's the inside. Uh, it's still pretty. And the next one is this one here. Over oh, this one, I use a different trim. I use a a trim that I got from Daiso, I think, when I went to Daiso a long time ago. So this is a sequin trim. It's so pretty. And a flower and some chipboard stickers. And that's it. And the last one is very simple. I just put the pom pom trim and this sticker from from Walmart, I think. Valentine sticker from Walmart. And yes, those are the treat boxes that I make using this die. And the last one is this uh, popcorn die. Same thing, I ordered this online. So this is the die that I use. Also very good size. That one, I made three treat holders using that die. Okay, this one here, and uh, I put the pom pom trim all over it. On the top and the bottom, I just put a red bling, and the back is just like that. And okay, let's take out this one. And I put this Michael's flower, I put this sticker here, and I put a little heart that's a, I think that's a Jolie's Boutique heart that I got from Dollarama. And I put some shreddeds here, and I'm planning to put these chocolates inside, and I made this tag using a heart die and some cute stamps from my stash, and I put, you are so sweet, I just color them using my watercolor. And that would be ready to go. This would be nice to give to teachers. I'm planning to give this to my kids' teachers. And some friends. So that's the first one. And the second one is basically the same. I just use a different paper. Put the pom-pom trim. Put this I love you sticker. Put pearls. And the bottom there. And here. I colored up my kid stamp. And it says you are so cool. And the last one is this one here. So yeah, basically they're all the same. Pom-pom trim, flower, uh, stickers, and the bling at the bottom. And I uh, made this heart tag. It says, you are so sweet. Yes, and I think that's it for my um, Valentine's Treat Holders share. But I'll be back because I'm going to share... Uh, more Valentine's project. Hope you like this one and leave me a comment if you have any questions and thank you guys for watching. Have a good day everyone. Bye!